Hey everyone, how you doing? So, as you can see, unfortunately, both of my Atlas Beetles have died. The male, which is this one here, um, actually died a few weeks ago, and I did my best to dry him out. Um, I wasn't sure whether to just discard him or what, but I thought that it'd be better to um, mount them. I thought they're quite interesting looking insects. It'd be pretty cool to, to have a go at doing this. And it's all right. It's not the best job in the world, but uh, for the first time doing it, I'm quite happy with it, to be honest. Um, the female, who's this one here, who's obviously quite a bit smaller, she died last week, um, and so I again um, dried her out, and then uh, once I dry them out, I put them in a tub, wrapped in um, damp tissue paper to just soften them up, and then I uh, unhinged the wings. Uh, unfolded the wings out and uh, got them mounted and I actually still have my rhino beetle so I might actually do a video showing how to actually do the mounting if that's something that you'd be interested in seeing let me know and um, I will do a video on how to mount these so um, but yeah so here they are both of them see I've got the wings out the wings are awesome and uh, they're actually really tough You'd be surprised at how strong these wings are. They feel like um, very tough paper, I suppose. Kind of leathery as well. Uh, so you can see there's the the female. And here is the awesome male. The pins are just also there to try and hold him still while I was actually doing the mounting. And so yeah, so they are completely dried out now. And what I'm going to do with these is, um, well, I'm thinking about doing. Um, again, I'm not sure, but either way, I'm going to get these framed up. Uh, I'll probably do one per frame, or if I get a big one, get them both, um, you know, in these big, deep uh, frames. Um, and then I was thinking about maybe doing like an auction with them, and all the money uh, raised for you know, whoever wins them. On like a bid, will go to a charity, um, which I would then donate to uh, one of my next motorcycle rides. So it's um, you know that way people who watch the, the videos and like these and would actually like to have a look at the, you know have a look at them. Um, you know you can if you think it's a good idea, let me know. You know because maybe get these sold um, and all the money, every single penny will go to. Like I said, one of the next charity runs that I do, which I do a lot of charity work anyway, but that way, you know, you're happy, uh, you know, if you've got, you know, these uh, framed, and then obviously I'll be happy because I'll be able to give a little bit extra. So, um, just an idea, if you think that's a good idea, let me know in the comments below and I will um, consider it. And if you think uh, it's best, maybe just keep them in my collection or keep looking at them. Again, you know, I have no problem doing that because they are fantastic. Um, and like I said, if you'd like to see a video of me actually mounting one of these awesome insects, um, yeah, let me know in the comments below and I will do a video. So, yeah, unfortunately, I didn't do, I did uh, quite a few videos of these which I didn't upload. Um, but, um, you know, as always, if you would like me to get more of these awesome, awesome uh, beetles, or some even bigger ones, let me know. I will uh, happily get some. Uh, if I get a... Uh, let's get a CD. You can just see how big they are compared to a CD. Um, I'd say the wingspan is actually probably... They got a longer wingspan than a, a CD, so decent, uh, decent size. So anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to uh, comment below. Let me know what you think. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe if you aren't already. And uh, check back for more videos. Okay, everyone. Thank you for watching. Take care, and I'll see you soon.